Hello everyone, this is today's video analysis for March 21st, 2017. Today we're going to take a look at the AUD USD, the Australian dollar versus the US dollar for today's trade analysis. Now yesterday we had a pretty slow market, not much happened during the US trading session yesterday, so we didn't have a lot of opportunity to get into any clear or significant trades. We did have a pending order during the live trade room, but the market never went up and took us in before falling on the GBP USD. So one opportunity missed just because it didn't take us into the pending order, but we have an opportunity I think here on the AUD USD to go short into a key resistance level. If you look at the very top of the chart, the green colored shaded area, I've put some black circles and blue circles along that green zone. So we can see how key this resistance zone has been for the past year. We're going back into March of 2016 along that green zone and seeing those historic areas of resistance all along there. I could even throw in an additional circle that's not on here just to show you just another instance where the market came up into this area right there's another black circle so uh, you can see all along there so the reason I pointed out of course is that's where we are right now the market is testing this area the 7720 to 7745 level that's the green shaded area we're testing into it now the historic probability here is that we could find resistance and reversal. That's what's happened for the past year. There's really only been one instance all the way back there in April of last year where it got actually got above this green zone for the past year and went all the way up to the yellow zone at the top of the chart. So the probability tells us that there's a good chance that we're going to find at least some intraday resistance. Yesterday we did. We found some interest, intraday resistance into this level. Let's go and zoom it in a little bit here on the daily. Let's go in a couple of times. You can see yesterday, actually, if we go back one, two, three, four days, finding resistance into this green zone. We're tapping a little bit into it today, but definitely finding resistance into this green shaded area, as you would expect, as the history tells us. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and take a short here into this level. 77.35 is my uh, order that I'm taking here for the Australian dollar today. We have minimal risk. The risk is, of course, it breaks above this green zone. So what I'm actually going to do is place a stop loss that will be just above the green zone. That way, if it breaks above it, we don't have too much risk. We don't stand losing a lot of money if it breaks finally above that level. If it doesn't and found, finds its resistance, we'll look at first to target the blue shaded area. We know that that has some historical support there in that area. Beyond there, we could look to target the orange zone or even lower down to the purple zone. But if the first example here that we're looking at is looking to go short here on the AUD USD into the green shaded area, targeting the blue or the orange zone on the way down. Let's take one last look at the four hour time frame. And as we get down here to the four hour time frame, we are seeing a little bit of a bullish move uh, as it pushes back into the green shaded area. But as long as it stays underneath 77.45, I still think that this is a viable low risk, high reward opportunity. Again, it's not too hard to see here on the four hour time frame that the blue zone would be your first target. You can see what happened the last time we bounced off of this level right here we came down to the blue zone and then beyond there we'll go to the orange zone if it breaks through there and even down to the purple shaded area down here towards the middle bottom of the chart the risk again is pretty simple we just don't want it to get above this green shaded area and if it does we'll get out of it and look for a new opportunity for the australian dollar today